Hey guys, Mark from Fred and Ford. Check it out, acoustics. Yeah, you know, I'd like to try to help you choose an acoustic, and before buying, let's take a look at some tips. I'd like to give you some, because when I grew up and when I was looking out for acoustics, nobody was able to give me some buying tips. You know, so before you go out and purchase, hang with me. Let's see what uh, I would look for now if I had the chance and opportunity to go back then to know what I know now and purchase back then. Yeah, let's go over it. Most importantly, first thing I do, do it in person. Go out and try these guitars in person. As you can hear in the background, there's a few guys playing in the other room. There's three of them. They're all jamming, all checking it out in person. So the first thing I would do, most importantly, go out and touch them and play them. Touch them and feel them. Hey, you've heard that before. Touch and feel. Go out and play. Next thing, strings. Strings are important. Decide what you want to play. Nylon, steel. Make the choice before you come to the store. You know, come to the store. Test drive. Test drive which ones you like. Steel or the nylon. And, you know, go from there. Best thing to do is come to the store and uh, test drive them. Some guitars you've got to put, you know, your hand around them. Some necks are going to sing for you and sing to you, and some aren't. The nylon strings are going to have a wider base, if you will, uh, a wider fretboard. Uh, the steel strings the steel strings are going to have uh, less white, if you will, thinner at this, at this angle. So pick and choose what's for you. If you were thinking about a nylon, pick up the steel. And if you're thinking about the steel, pick up the nylon. You know, try them both. Best thing to do is to get down to the store, I keep mentioning, and try them out. Test drive them. Next thing you want to do is look at the frets. For me, I need jumbo frets. For my fingers, and I've only got three to work with, of course, as I mentioned, uh, I need jumbo frets to catch my fingers. The thinner frets on some of the instruments just don't work for me. So, yeah, try to feel out the frets and, you know, what's going to work for you. The size of them. I like the jumbo ones, as I mentioned. They work for me. Catch my fingers well and, you know, figure out what's right for you. Then, put it on your lap and play it. See if it's comfortable, however you're going to sit. Put it on your knee, put it on your thigh wrap it around make sure you've got some nice comfort zones you know for your arm there's no sharp edges make sure there's no you know digging into your leg and thigh most of us when we're playing guitar we're going to play sitting down sitting on a chair sitting on this bar stool like i am right now put it on your lap see how comfortable it is figure it out you'll figure it out figure out the ergonomics and see if it works for you strum it a little bit once again, check that arm motion on the back of the guitar. Feel how comfort it is on your lap. Most of us, once again, are, we're going to play it like this on our lap. So yeah, check the ergonomics. This one's got a beautiful shape to it. This is an ovation. Probably not fair for uh, the uh, ergonomics and dynamics because uh, generally most guitars aren't built this way, like the ovation. But as I twist it and turn it, you can see how wonderfully contoured it is for one's lap, one's body, up against one's chest. You see that? Yeah, so put it on your lap and play it. And lastly, but not leastly, <laughs> if we make some words as we go along, play it, strum it. You gotta hear it resonate to you. to you with all these tips that I give along with the the sound how it resonates to you I hope these tips help you in purchasing and, and shopping for a guitar if you go out and shop and you don't find it the first time go out a second time if you don't find it go out a third time keep on shopping keep looking for one that sings to you like this one this one's beautiful I just happen to stumble across this one you never know what you're gonna go out and find go out and play 
Thanks for watching, you guys.